The Indonesian Ministry of Agriculture seeks to maintain the availability of fertilizers as well as optimizing the distribution of subsidized fertilizers to farmers by involving the ombudsman. These efforts are being made to address supply chain disruptions of global fertilizer raw materials that have an impact on the availability of domestic fertilizers in Indonesia. In a coordination meeting of the management and supervision of subsidized fertilizers for 2023, the Indonesian Minister of Agriculture, Shairul Yassin Limpo, said that Indonesian House has agreed to change the subsidized fertilizer policy through a ministerial regulation on how to determine the location and highest retail price of subsidized fertilizers in the agricultural sector. The Director General of Agriculture Infrastructure and Facilities, Ali Jamil, said that the ministry is involving the Ombudsman and the Police's Special Corruption Prevention Unit team to oversee the distribution of subsidized fertilizers to farmers. The Ombudsman is the leader of the Ombudsman in the Ombudsman. The Ombudsman is the leader of the Ombudsman. The Ombudsman is the leader of the Ombudsman. di dalam tata kelola bumbu subsidi kita sehingga kita uh, bergandengan dengan teman-teman uh, dari Ombudsman uh, di bawah pengawasan mereka tentunya koordinasi kita semuanya bersama-sama bagaimana tata kelola bumbu subsidi kita ini bisa kita tingkatkan dengan baik. The role of the Ombudsman is needed to improve subsidized fertilizer governance to improvements in subsidized fertilizers policy planning. This includes budget design in the subsidized fertilizer program, improving the criteria for farmers receiving subsidized fertilizers, data collection, distribution, and redemption, and supervision by the Fertilizer and Pesticide Supervisory Commission. Bayu hukumnya berupa apa? Berupa surat alokasi yang ditandatangani oleh Bupati dan Gubernur. Dan Ombudsman sudah mengawasi Gubernur dan Bupati dan Wali Kota untuk menetapkan SA itu sebelum memasuki tahun 2023 ini. Nah, setelah itu Ombudsman akan mengawasi apakah hukum itu tepat waktu, tepat sasaran, ya, dan itu harus ada di lapangan. Changes in the government policy and ministerial regulations include changes in fertilizer types from urea, SP36, ZANPK, organic to urea and NPK. Changes in designation to conduct farming business. Meanwhile, only farms with a maximum land area of 2 hectares for 9 basic and strategic food commodities can receive the subsidies, such as rice, corn, soybeans, coffee and cocoa.